This is Jordan Tower with JT News. Make sure you smash that like button, hit that subscribe button. Let's get right into it. What Casanova reacts to Pop Smoke getting popped for having a stolen Rolls Royce, which is like the craziest, dumbest thing I've heard in a long time. There better be a good backstory to this because like, like I said, he works up and out with some guy to borrow the Rolls Royce for a day, never returned it, shipped it to New York and kept it for a while. Like that doesn't even make sense. Uh, and they were going to do a return and getting like VIP treatment for being backstage or something. Well, Casanova said he's not going to wish jail on anybody, free him. But for him calling him Trashanova, he's going to knock his teeth out when he get, when he sees him next time. And, you know, and then he says, until then, Brooklyn forever. You know, Brooklyn, there's always going to be competition in rap, especially Brooklyn just can't get along. Queens can't get along either, remember? Everybody was beefing the Queens at one point. You know, it's just it's just a New York thing, okay? People beef with each other. There's I've never seen just peace. Uh, we saw during the G-Unit days, every crew was having some issue with each other. It was just, it's crazy, man. So, you know, that's just how it is up there. Uh, the same's happening in Atlanta, too. It, it just, it's natural competition. Um, then we got Eminem. Um, you know, obviously, he said what he said about Machine Gun Kelly. Machine Gun Kelly's, you know, now he's popping bottles talking about it. He's done three videos talking about how uh, this verse was trash and this and that. But, you know, he's really happy to just be mentioned by his uh, father, Eminem. You know, that's uh, MGK is definitely his son for sure. Uh, it'll forever be that way. Even though MGK is great, he exists in his own space. Eminem exists in his own space. But we can't. Uh, look over the fact that, uh, hey, this guy is a stan. You know, when he was, when that music video stan came out, that was MGK in the video. Then we got um, the baby actually reacting and making sense out of what happened in that hotel video. He said, that hotel worker you see me pushing came up to me outside my hotel and asked if he could record a video of me while I was holding my two-year daughter. I calmly and respectfully said, no, I can see him doing that. He seems like a calm person and respectful. But... Um, <coughs> he and, and said no one explained to him posting a video of me at that time would compromise my safety me and my child so then after being told no uh, he walked to the other side of the parking lot 50 feet away zoomed in while recording a video of me and my daughter on snapchat and politely asked him not to and gave him an explanation why he can't I then handed my daughter to her uncle and walked over to him as I was typing his, uh, at, oh, to, as he was typing his caption, um, to not tell him not to post it. I told him delete the video immediately, um, or it'll be a problem. And, uh, he just wouldn't do it. So then, uh, upon entering the hotel, I made him sit down and understand the fact that no video is worth the safety of my child. Um, not to mention the fact that it's, he's at work and his job is to valet park cars, not record customers. It's facts. Okay. Uh, being a celebrity in being, uh, is being like in the public is cool. I'm a father, blah, 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 blah. And anybody that doesn't respect that, uh, don't want your respect. Then he said, and TMZ while continuously attempting to assassinate my character with the incomplete, uh, judgmatic stories. Y'all let the Beverly Hills AC Hotel know that my lawyer will be in contact if they don't provide my legal team with a video of their employee violating my company policy, of a violating company policy by asking me and continuing to record me. Yeah, so that guy should be fired. I mean, come on. You know, that's crazy. Uh, I agree with the baby. You can't, unfortunately, you know, you can't. Past a certain age, you just can't take things in your own hands, especially when you're a celebrity. Um, but I understand him overreacting. I mean, that's his daughter, you know? So now that we have a backstory to this, it makes sense. Um, and I think that the guy, he should have probably gone to the manager right away and had something done. But uh, I understand. I do understand. Sometimes you don't think about that. You think about, okay, you know, once that video goes out, it's forever, you know? You can't wait to have it posted and then be you're in jeopardy. This is Jordan Tower with JT News. I appreciate you guys and I'll keep you guys up to date as the day goes on.